Boys in the back, bring us the memes about the election. Nobody prepared me for the this. The election memes about this great, great election. Aha! Uh -huh. Joe Biden! What am I looking at? You're lo Joe Biden. <laughs> You're looking at Joe Biden in a tracksuit smoking a ciggy. No, you, you can describe all the things in the image. I still don't understand what I'm looking at. What? <laughs> I don't know. He's what's kind of cool, kind of nifty. That's what he's going to wear for his presidency. This is my favorite oh. one. This is my favorite thing. Because, okay, listen, I had, like, this high schooler somehow end up on my Snapchat, and she would send these to her streaks just about twice a week. And so it just it makes me think of her. Donald Trump as a high school girl. Logging out, don't hit me up. Real friends know what's wrong. Streaks. Who do you think his real friends are? Definitely not Fauci. Well, <laughs> I'll think about that in a second. But what I was going to say is, like, I saw this meme and I didn't, is it, um, I'm not really part of society because I don't have Snapchat. But I love this meme just because it looks to me like a picture somebody got or he accidentally got and accidentally sent to somebody. <laughs> it wasn't supposed to go out. And, of course, the Internet naturally grabbed it, preserved grabbed it, it, circulated again <sighs> like this. And I just, lo I just love that it exists. Like, where is he? Who are these people? Is he on an airplane? Or something. There's some guy smiling in the corner over there. Yeah. There it is. What is that? Miss Congeniality. That's what this makes me think it's of. A is good Miss, one. Miss Congeniality, which is, of course, I don't know. I don't know if we can call this his reaction, though. Only if uh, we've got William Shatner at the inauguration. At the inauguration. Which that's a requirement. That's happening now, right? It is. Yeah. You heard it here first, folks. William, William Shatner William at Shatner the inauguration. Be at the inauguration. If we're wrong, is it libel? I can't remember. Who knows, man? Playing with my votes, like playing with my emotions. <laughs> Sad boy. Look at him. It's like a. It's like our interview guy said in the the package. Is it playing with votes. We weren't watching him. Yeah. Who knows what was going on? Yeah. Uh, his emotions now. I feel like now the election's over, we can take a minute to sit down and just think about, like, what, what are his emotions doing? How does he feel without having to worry as much about how does that affect policy? We can no just, one, like, put the man back in his reality show. No one ever asks how Donald Trump is feeling. Do you think that bothers him? No one ever asks how is Donald. I don't think it does. I think he's the most unbothered man in the world. I guess. Oh, we got another one. <laughs> <laughs> this is the best one. This is the one. That's the tweet. This is nice. I like this one. This makes me think of, uh, you know, the, the, the dude in the package who was talking about it in what I, I thought looks like a sports game, you know? It's like, it's, yeah. it's, it's pretty good, I guess, you know? Um, <laughs> Biden was, you know, up a, few, up a few frags, up a few kills, and then Trump comes in with the, I don't know. The thing that makes me excited is that I feel like this is something that could actually happen. Not so much Donald Trump, but we already have AOC on Twitch. Yes. Right? Yeah. Like, maybe Biden will jump on. That would be fun. That'd <laughs> cute. Biden on I Twitch, mean. that's a revolution. The Way Life Goes, featuring Oh Wonder by Lil Uzi Vert. Oh Wonder. Yeah, I've seen a lot of these. They're really funny where he gets on and he just where posts, he he posts sad boy lyrics. He's like, the music. It's like, it's like. It, it's another thing that reminds me of like a like a teenage like little angst filled girl who's like posting what she's listening to she just broke up with her mans of about a week and a half her heart's absolutely shattered on the floor mm. and she's like i'm listening to some lana right now I except know, I, I don't think, think trump's taste is good enough for i lana. think we're gonna get four years of uh, angsty lincoln park lyrics on his twitter stream that's gonna be it <laughs> It's going to be like Edward Cullen listening it's, to Linkin Park. That's going to be it. That's, that's it. Just, just Linkin Park from the mouth of, you know, where, oh, yeah. Of course, Orange was ejected. Oh, yeah. He was, he was definitely sus the entire time. This one I love. I feel like it really encapsulates the mood. It encapsulates the mood. Maybe not everybody's mood, but, like, I'm really feeling this one, like, uh, you know, a firm finger point at, hey, I think this is the one who sabotaged the whatever, you know, the... The, the comm system and the yeah. analogy or the public services in real life. In it's real like, life, well, what yeah. do we do? Oh, well, we have to call a vote at the ship you meeting and then eject this guy. Exactly. <laughs> Among it's just us such a, is such like, a strong it's analogy. It's a real life analogy. Wow. Yeah. Wow. Look at that. 
this. <laughs> Have you seen the memes that are like, um, or it's more like tweets where they're like, hey, UK, we're really sorry we misbehaved. Can we come home now? Mm -hmm. That's what this one reminds me of. We came home. Jo Joe Biden's part of the royal family secretly. Exactly. <laughs> uh, Joe Biden's, what is it, a loyalist? Is that what they were called? A, a Tory, I a think, Tory? is what they were called, yeah. He wants to... I think we were wrong. Our history major oh, were is we very disappointed oh, in us. Oh, please correct us. Not Tories. Were they loyalists? They were loyalists. They were Whoa, loyalists. Aha! Okay. Tories were kind of like the middle point. Okay. Look at me. And Tories are a, an existing political party. Yeah. In, in, in England. Yeah, yeah. Okay. 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 Joe Biden confirmed loyalist. That sums up how much we know about the United Kingdom. I even went there one time. Oh, so. man. I've seen on TV. Oh, there it is. Yeah. Cup we are. So this is how fascism dies between a <laughs> dildo shop and a crematorium. Do we know for sure if that's what uh, Four Seasons landscaping is? Is that the real estate that we're looking at here? Is it for sure between a dildo shop and a crematorium? No, that's like a thing. Oh, my that's God. That's a thing. It was between a dildo shop and a crematorium. Oh that's God. real life. There's a meme um, I sent uh, Chris that is uh, it's like on the next season or, or the next episode of Arrested Development. And you've got Giuliani out in front of uh, Four Seasons landscaping shop giving the press conference. I don't know God. if you got that up here, but like, out of all the places they could have chose, I really don't think they did their research on it. I like the theory. Nobody knows, but the speculation is that they try to get Four Seasons Hotel either because the campaign wanted to do it, or I think this is probable the president wanted to do it, and then they're like Four Seasons. The, the hotel was like no, you, you, we're not letting this happen they, for whatever reason. Absolutely and they were just not. like, crap, grab something. Get grab something, something with, the, with the name relation. With the name Maybe relation. Maybe nobody will notice. No one's going to notice. No one will Nobody's know. paying attention to my national campaign for president. Response to the MAGA hat. Oh, what does it say? We just did? We just did. Yeah, it says we just did. Huh. I've not seen that. It's hard to see. Okay. Make America great again. We just did. I think probably the smartest thing Joe Biden did was like his uh, his PR guys, their whole like settle for Biden and like the way they did their merch was actually really clever because nobody wanted to vote for Joe Biden. But we knew that in order to get the freaking fascist Cheeto out, we would have to at least settle for somebody. Just temporarily put the genie back in the bottle, then see if we can keep him there. Exactly, exactly, exactly. Just waiting. You have freed us. I wouldn't say freed, more like under new management. What What is this from? I don't think I've seen this movie. What is this movie? This looks like a DreamWorks film. It does look like DreamWorks. Is that like his wife? Is that supposed to be like a husband and wife? Oh, it's Megamind! Me I never saw Megamind. Oh my god, don't let my fiancé see this. He's going to be upset. I heard good things, but I never saw it. I've never seen it, and my fiancé is obsessed with it. <laughs> <Make it fun. laughs> yeah. Under new management. Yeah. I will say that's true because Joe Biden's definitely a moderate. Is there any more? Are we are we out of memes? Okay. I think that was the last meme. All right, that was Somebody our last the meme, guys. No more. I hope you enjoyed our uh, meme talk. I'm gonna thank Grant for coming on the show. Oh, thank you for having pretty me. Pretty cool, man. You're not anything compared to Dave Chappelle. Well, um, you know, it's just but, a, nice to be in the same bracket. No, oh, that's fair. That's fair. But we'll uh, we'll see you again soon after the break.